We've got news about a new weight loss alternative. Until recently, many procedures involved surgery and they were reserved for the morbidly obese. But now there is a new non-surgical treatment for people trying to lose at least 40 pounds. It's called endoscopic sleeve gastroplasty. That rolls off the tongue <laughs> or the accordion procedure. NBC's medical correspondent, Dr. John Torres, is here to tell us about it. Hi, Dr. Torres. Good morning. Good morning. So, so who is the ideal candidate for what we're going to call the accordion procedure? Yeah, right. The accordion procedure is much easier. The ideal candidate is somebody who wants to lose 40 to 60 pounds. They're obese or, or beyond obese. They've tried other weight loss procedures. They've tried medical weight loss techniques. They've tried exercise. They've tried uh, diets, all sorts of things that haven't worked for them. And it's somebody who doesn't want surgery or can't have surgery because they have other medical conditions because this is much, much less invasive. Okay, so it's not a surgery, but it is an endoscopy, which is quite a, an ordeal to go through. How it's, does it work? So it's a procedure, but it's it's scarless. It doesn't go through the skin. It's basic endoscopy. They put you under general anesthesia, lay you on your side. They put a tube through your mouth down into your stomach. The doctor sees the stomach, and then they sew up the sides. They pleat the sides of the stomach. And what they do is they make it into a tube about the size of a banana. Since it's a smaller tube, you eat less. Since you eat less, you have less calories, mm -hmm. and that causes the weight loss. And is it general anesthesia, like you go completely under, or just kind of a light sedation? No, it's, a, it's actually general anesthesia, but they okay. do send you home the same day. You, re, you recover after a couple hours and end up going home right away. So it's, again, less, less invasive. All right, so you go home the same day, but you don't bounce right back. What's the recovery like? So the recovery is about a two-week period of drinking just liquid diet, and that's to let the sutures settle in, let the, the tissues on the side heal a little bit, yeah. and then you get the smaller stomach. So what the doctors say, and I agree with them, is this is not a procedure by itself. This is a procedure like the other surgeries that come hand in hand with diet as well. So you have to maintain a special diet throughout the rest of your life, basically. You know, just eating smaller portions is what it is, and you lose the weight that way. Yeah, and what kind of results have people been getting? I mean, are you seeing dramatic weight loss? Right, especially for the fact that this is non-invasive. So this is for people that, again, don't want to go through those big surgeries or aren't morbidly obese. And, and weight loss is dramatic. After a year, people are losing 17% of their weight. After two years, 21%. They're losing 10 inches in their waist size mm. alone. And for me as a doctor, probably the most important thing is they're getting their health parameters under control. Their cholesterol is better, their diabetes control is better, their, their blood pressure is better. So all these things are helping them live a healthier and a longer life. All right, basically. we got to get, because a lot of people are going to say, this sounds good to me. First of all, what are the risks? And second of all, what does it cost? Would insurance cover it at all? So again, this is a very low procedure invasive wise. And so the risks are, are minimal. The risks from this, people had nausea, they had stomach cramps, went away after a few days. One person in the study out of 91 had a leakage that they took care of with antibiotics. But beyond that, the risks after two years were minimal. Mm -hmm. at Insurances sometimes cover it, sometimes don't. It's not quite like bariatric surgery yet because it's still brand new. And so insurances sometimes might cover it. If they don't, ten to $15,000 is the procedure. But we talked to Jahidi who had it. We had it on nightly last night. Yeah. She says it's well worth the cost. Yeah, and it's for not just the morbidly obese, but those who qualify that, as obese. So a wider group right, of people that's that what could makes be it available. Different. It opens it up to more people. Dr. Torres, good information. Thank you so much you for bet. being here.